Hello everybody and welcome back to the Brickazoid's Den. Today I want to talk about a game that uh, was recently revealed called Multiverses, which looks really cool, it's by uh, WB. And it's all like Warner Bros. characters and different properties all coming together into like a Smash Bros. type fighter. And um, yeah, I thought I'd kind of talk about the reveal of this game because... I remember I was scrolling through Instagram and I saw like a leaked character roster for this game and I'm like, oh, I don't think that that doesn't really look real and it was right after that Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl game came out so I'm like, oh, maybe it's just, you know, kind of like a fan thing maybe if, you know, uh, uh, Cartoon Network and a group like that uh, did a fighter game like that so I didn't actually think anything of it but it's it, it exists, it's real it's coming out in 2022 I don't think there was an exact date, but I think... And it's going to be free-to-play as well, which is kind of nuts. And Finn and Jake are in it as, like, fighters, which is kind of crazy. I've, I've always wanted, like, a, a a fighting game with... An Adventure Time fighting game. I think that would be really fun. But now, now it's basically happening. There was other characters. There was, like, DC characters in there. Um, I think there was a Game of Thrones character. I don't watch that show, but I do know of it. Um... <clears throat> yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I think it was uh, Looney Tunes and Tom and Jerry as well. Either way... It looks really cool. I'm actually really, really excited for this game. So I thought, yeah, I just thought I would take kind of take a look at it. website right now. The the uh, the game has a website here. I thought I would just kind of scroll around, take a look, because I didn't really do a lot of uh, peeking at, at all the stuff that is included. I'm already seeing some characters here, which looks pretty cool. Um, I guess we can start with characters, to be honest with you. I'm very curious about this. So there's Arya Stark, which is the Game of Thrones character. Oh, so they have, like, special moves, too. I, I don't really play, um, what's it called? The, um, Super Smash Bros. kind of games. I, I'm more of, like, a Mortal Kombat type player. Um, what, what are those things, what are those games called? Um, plat Platform Fighters, I believe. I'm not crazy about those types of games, but I'll definitely play this, to be honest with you. So that, that's pretty cool. They have her in there. They got Batman, of course, right, right? Um... It's pretty cool. Bugs Bunny. Oh, so there's like different classes too. Hold on, I gotta go back. Assassin. Batman is a bruiser. Okay. Mage or range. This is the first time I've ever actually seen any uh, information on this game. Uh, I, I just went to this website for the first time here. Finn the Human. Oh my god, an assassin. That's so cool. I definitely want to play Finn and Jake. I see Jake in here as well. Uh, you can also probably see him as well. Um... January wow, well, let's say like a little bio description of who these characters are. Whoops, I almost got rid of the screen there. Garnet from Steven Universe. I didn't know that uh, they were doing Steven Universe characters. That's pretty cool. She's a bruiser. I don't really watch that show much, but I do know of it. Harley Quinn, okay. Assassin. Jake, ah, oh, that's so cool. Oh my god, that's super cool. He's a bruiser, that's cool. Rain Dog, who's this? Support. Um, oh. Oh, it's like their own character? Oh, that's cool. That's very cool. Nice. I like that. Shaggy. He's a bruiser. Okay. Um, what's the change? Wait, what's the change? The last thing Shaggy remembers before the change was exploring another spooky manager with his old pal Scoop. And he found a strange glowing crystal and thinking it was raw candy. What is this? Incredible powers. Does he have like superpowers in this game? Are they doing the meme thing? With like the Matthew Lillard uh, shaggy thing? <laughs> Steven Universe, he's a support class. Superman's a bruiser. Tom and Jerry, mage ranged. Wonder Woman's a tank class. She's the only one. And then more revealed. That's pretty cool. So they're going to have a lot of uh, characters in here then. Oh, very cool. Very cool. Okay. So that, that's cool. You know, 13 characters it looks like here. That's pretty it's pretty good. Yeah, game overview. Iconic characters. Oh, look at that. Oh, I didn't see this. Oh, that looks so cool. This background. And, and is that Jake turning into a horse? Whoa, wait. That actually looks super cool. All right, we'll get out of that. What is that? Cro oh, cross-platform. That's cool. Got some modes. Different costumes. Competitive, growing multiverse, so more characters, regularly updated with new character stages, modes, and game events, variants, and more. I actually might, like, really, really want to play this game. I do. PS4. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. You can join their playtests as well down here. Um, can I watch the trailer? Oh, I can. Cool. 
Can we do this? You want to turn it up a little bit? Oh, that might be a little too loud. I'm Tony, the game director and co-founder here at Player First Games. We're here today to give you hmm. a first look. I guess this is going to be also my uh, reaction to the trailer as well. I, I, I haven't watched this yet. About two years ago, okay. question. Can we create a platform oh my god, oh, wait. Everything we love about the genre. Oh, actually, that was really good. It brings in some new ideas. Oh, I want to see adventure time characters in play. Oh my god. Oh, actually, I'm seeing Finn and Jake right now a lot. Bugs Bunny, that's pretty cool. Wow, actually, that looks really cool. Free to play, yeah. I heard about that, yeah. There's Jake! Oh, so, you, so there's like a leveling up system I just noticed as well. That's pretty cool. Oh, that's cool. Batman looks cool in this. Yeah. Good save, Wonder Woman. Thank you for saving Finn. <gasps> there's Finn again. Oh, I'm actually really excited to play Finn and Jake. I hope they're they're my. Uh, I hope that they're uh, my mains. I hope I like their gameplay. <clears throat> I bet I will though. Oh, that's actually really cool. Oh, okay. So they do single player too. Cause they were talking about team matches a lot. It looks like. No, Finn lost? That's not cool. Jake. Oh, that's so cool. Don't hit Jake. Whoa, wait, is that like his uh, recovery move? Is he can like stretch up? That's cool. There's Finn. I don't, I'm only focusing on the Adventure Time characters here. Yeah, like, that's like my biggest draw for this game. That's really cool. We think you'll recognize a lot of them. Mm. Oh, that's, oh, that's cool. That's cool. <laughs> oh my god, that's actually so cool. Yeah. Wait, they did they do the they actually did the meme thing? Each fighter in multiverses is unique and will have a range of customizations available for all of them. And that's He actually has meme power. That's pretty cool. Look at him! Shaggy. I hope they bring Scooby in this game too. That'd be pretty cool. You can focus on what's important. Who you'll play with on what platform. Make it. That also means guilds. Oh, that's cool. So you can like so there's like team moves that they can uh, I guess I didn't catch that. I'm trying to We'll have leaderboards and other ways. Oh, wait. Remember the last time you DC'd from a match? What about lag affecting your inputs? Us too. Multiverse's goal is best in class online. Huh, best okay. Into making the most responsive game That's cool. So I'm seeing different outfits for some characters, which I think we saw a little bit when we were looking through the uh, the main page there. Oh, Jake's a house. That's cool. Um, but yeah, I, I saw some different uh, outfits for like Steven Universe specifically. He had like an orange shirt and then his regular pink as well. Oh, whoa, wait, there's like a... Whoa, that's... Yeah, look, there, there's a... Oh my, oh my god! Just as we were talking about it. Oh, Shaggy. <laughs> Or Don't freeze Finn. Oh. oh. That's Kevin Conroy. Oh. Whoa, wait, this actually looks really cool. Again, this is the first time. This is like my reaction to this whole game, I guess, after I, I just saw that original roster. But this actually looks really, really cool. I will definitely play this game. <laughs> Although Shaggy has like the the powers for this meme, he only uses like uh, 0 0.000001 of his power. All right, so player first games. I don't think I've ever heard of them. Warner Bros. Worldwide 2022. So they, I guess they don't have an official date yet. Uh, oh yeah, here here we go. Here's all the characters with all the voice actors as well. Kevin Conroy, George Newbern. Abby Trot, Tara, oh, Tara Strong, Matthew Lillard, is Shaggy, that's so cool. Uh, John DiMaggio, Jeremy Shada. That's cool, that's actually really cool, wow. I just wanted to add this on here. This is, I found the, uh, a picture of the original roster that I saw on, uh, an Instagram, this is obviously isn't on Instagram, but, so there was still that Rain Dog character, there was Steven Universe, there was Batman, Harley Quinn, uh, Finn, Jake, Shaggy, Superman, Wonder Woman. There's Gandalf from Lord of the Rings. And then there's also Rick from Rick and Morty. And there's Bugs Bunny and Tom, Jer Tom and Jerry. So, who are they missing? So it's Garnet they didn't, they, they changed, or changed to Garnet, whatever. And then Arya Stark, I believe. Yeah, I believe that's it. So they just changed those two. But still, to be honest with you, I think I kind of would rather have Rick and Gandalf in the game. But they'll probably, maybe they'll be added later in the future. Uh, I think Rick would be a really cool character. 
And I guess Gandalf would be cool too. He'd be a mage. Their projectile. Oh, it looks like Rick would also be a projectile. I'm just kind of noticing his little icon there. So they swapped him out with a, a, a bruiser and then an assassin class, which is interesting. All right, yeah, yeah. So th this would actually be really cool. I'm actually really excited for this game. Um, hmm. Very cool. Anyways, I was just looking at the, the... I just wanted to show off the different roster here. All right, so I thought I would uh, add some uh, an extra part where I talk about some characters that I want in the future for this game because they said they're going to do regular updates, going to get some new characters in this game. So here are some ideas. So first off, number one is definitely Scooby-Doo. they got to add him in here. They have Shaggy. They need Scooby. Whether they give Scooby-Doo powers as well, I don't care. they got to have Scooby in there. Um, I also put Daffy Duck down because they have Bucks Bunny, uh, Bugs Bunny, not Bucks, Bugs Bunny in this game as well. So I put Daffy Duck on the list. Um, I also have, th th this one's just basically uh, uh, universal, any Adventure Time character, that'd be lovely. Princess Bubblegum, Ice King, Marceline, literally any of them. I would love more Adventure Time characters in the game, no matter who it is. But the obvious one might be Princess Bubblegum or Marceline or Ice King. I don't think they'd do anybody else. Um, maybe, maybe they will. I don't know. And then I also put down real quick Pearl and or Amethyst from uh, Steven Universe. Just a, uh, they, they were main characters in the show. I, I mean, I did not watch the show much, but I, I from what I did, I know that they were main characters. So it would be good to put them in the game as well. Um, I can't think of... like I, I'm trying to think of... Um, different properties and different franchises that Warner Bros. owns. I know they own a lot, um, and I can't think of anything. So maybe I'll look at, like, a, a Wikipedia page or something to try and get some ideas as well. I decided that I would take a look at uh, some of the Warner Bros. owned franchises in this video. I didn't know if I wanted to make it like a separate one or not, but I'll do it in this one. So I, I already kind of took a look at a few things here just to kind of get my ideas flowing. But um, I do want to go to here because I want to see, like, all, like, there's so many Cartoon Network uh, properties that they could do. Amazing World of Gumball would be pretty cool, Adventure Time. Yeah, I, I mean, this would be cool, but I, I don't know. I don't know. I feel like I'd want, uh, here, I'm trying to get to the, there it is, regular show characters. Rigby, Mordecai, perfect. Maybe even more. Oh, Wee Bear Bears would be cool. They already have Steven Universe in there, Powerpuff Girls, eh. Foster's Home, Dexter's Laboratory, co Codename Kids Next Door. That'd be cool. That'd be really cool. Chowder. Yeah, actually, no. Oh, courage, 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 the Cowardly Dog. Um, yeah, I, I, I definitely want uh, more Cartoon Network franchise characters in this game. And then Hanna-Barbera, Flintstones. Oh, yeah, this would be really cool. The original Powerpuff Girls, Scooby-Doo. They got to add Scooby in there. Space Ghost. That'd be really cool, too. Jetsons. Um, I mean, they already did Rick, so I guess this is kind of a uh, free game. Oh, Samurai Jack would be good. Definitely a good assassin class character there. Um, Rick and Morty, yeah. Uh, DC Comics. I mean, they already have four DC characters in that game. I don't think they. I don't. I don't want them to have more. To be honest with you, I mean, there's already you know Injustice, the Injustice franchise. They have. They have all the DC. That's that's where DC is. So. Yeah, no more DC characters. Four is enough, I think. Anyways, Austin Powers, Conjuring, Elf, Final Destination. So some, like, horror movies they could throw in there. Some Friday the 13th, uh, uh, Jason, Mortal Kombat. That'd be kind of cool if they got, like, Scorpion in there, but I don't think uh, NetherRealm would do that, to be honest with you. Teenage... Oh, the film series? Yeah, yeah. Oh, Nightmare on Elm Street I saw in there, too. I just saw that. Um, Do we just do this one? I'm just kind of I'm just gonna go through each one. Oh, this is a very small list here. Wizard of Oz would be cool though. Um, I'm just gonna go through each one and just kind of look at a few things to see. This is video games, so I want pictures. There we go. Oh, Beetlejuice. Beetlejuice. That would be cool. That would be really really cool. He'd be, he'd have some uh, wacky moves. He'd be pretty cool. Duck Dodgers. <laughs> Hang on, Harry Potter. Oh, Harry Potter. Yeah, Harry Potter would be pretty good. It, King Kong, the Lego movies, Looney Tunes, they already got them in there. Lord of the Rings, potentially, yeah. Matrix, Mortal Kombat. Oh, okay, okay. Willy Wonka, I saw them there, too. What's this one? Oh, television. Um. Yeah, right, nothing crazy there, to be honest with you. And then Japan franchises. 
Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't know a lot about them, but yeah, I don't know. I guess there was, I guess there was some stuff that Warner Bros. could do with, uh, with this game. I mean, there's definitely a lot of franchises, a lot of different characters that they could add. Um, yeah, no, I'm actually really excited for this game, to be honest with you. All right, so that's pretty much it. I just wanted to kind of take a look at this game, Multiverses, and, uh, and coming out in 2022, free to play, which is super exciting. I, I, I am, I'm really excited for this game. I haven't, I haven't played like a new video game in a little while because I've I've been waiting for um, Skywalker Saga and that ha obviously has been pushed back a lot since like 2019 I think we're going on like three years this game has been I've been waiting on this game I guess so um, yeah I haven't been I haven't been really playing a new Lego game or video game in general so very exciting to see that this is gonna come out next year I will definitely be playing this 1000 percent I want to try and master Finn and Jake. Because uh, I definitely, I, I've always wanted an Adventure Time fighting game like I previously said. So this is pretty big. This is pretty big. I'm really, really excited for this game. And uh, yeah, so if you enjoyed that video, do the common YouTube stuff. Like, comment, subscribe. And I will see you guys later.